And protests have spread to every corner of the country since George Floyd's death at the hands of police. Now, an organization is calling for specific changes to achieve justice. WCIA3's Karina Rubio talked to the Champaign County's NAACP president about what's being done. At the nonprofit's national level, organization leaders are outlining clear reforms it says it wants to see the nation's leaders put into place to evoke change. The NAACP want every law enforcement department to recognize what is needed in their city. What is the cry out for? For years, the NAACP has been at the forefront of the push for racial equality. The organization's branch president for Champaign County, Minnie Pearson, breaks down why these reforms are necessary. The intent is to make sure that if someone is breaking the law or breaking the rules, that they are ticketed or brought in safely and not harmed before they get a chance to go before the judge. The NAACP's goals are twofold. It's calling on the United Nations to help address police brutality in demanding federal legislation for a zero tolerance approach in, quote, penalizing or prosecuting officers who kill unarmed, nonviolent, and non resisting people in an arrest. Two of their specific reforms include a ban on knee and chokeholds as an acceptable practice for police officers and cities and towns to organize citizen review boards to hold police accountable. Pearson compares it to a classroom. When the expectations are given, unity follows. When you do it across the board, when everybody body buys into that and see the necessity of it, then there's consistency. In Champaign County, Karina Rubio, WCIA 3, your local news leader.